Hi all, I am Muhammad Niyazi Abu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we will be discussing about PyTorch multi-dimensional tensors. So we have been working with tensors, single dimensional, one time or like one dimensional tensors and its basic operations. So in this video, we will be focusing on multi-dimensional. Basically, we can focus on the two-dimensional matrix and its basic operations. Okay. So as usual, we can start with importing torch. Okay, so here can write create multi dimensional tensors. Let me add few cells. So, first let me create a torch to a tensor. So, there are multiple ways we can create a two dimensional tensor and that can be extended to like n dimensional tensors. Okay. So, torch your tensors, let me have like 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now, let me print the tensor, it is a single dimensional tensor. So, this can be the same as we discussed, this can be we can change to view, we can have 2 to minus 1. So, this will be converted to two dimensional tensors. So, it has a two rows and four columns. So, when we add minus one, this the column number of columns will be automatically dictated by the tensor, I mean dictated by the torch. Then another way of creating tensor is we can have m2 which is equal to torch dot randen. So, there is a function called randen. Here we can say number of rows and number of columns. Now print M2. So this will print a two dimensional tensor. So there is one more way we can discuss. We can have a rand range function we can create. So we found three and uh, we can create torch dot randen. Sorry, random like we already discussed, we can have a range. Here we can have um, values between 0 to 8. Okay, so this will give us a one dimensional tensor. So, similar to we have done in our first example, we can convert this to m3 dot view, we can have 2 dot minus 1 print m3 okay so this will give a two dimensional matrix with two rows and four columns okay now we can see how can we do a matrix multiplication okay consider a two dimensional tensor torch dot tensor can have 1 2 3 4 3, 4 and m1 dot view, let me make it m11 view 2 comma 2. This is our first matrix. Now we can have m2, m2 which will be equal to torch dot tensor, the same 1, 2, 2, 3, 4 this also can be converted to two dimensional m2 dot view 2 comma 2. Now, let me print both the m1 and m2, m1 and print m2. Okay. Now, to multiply these two matrix, okay, we have, we can write m1 into m2. Okay, so this will multiply element wise multiplication that means 1 into 1, okay, this position, this 0th position and this 0th position will be multiplied here, then 2 into 2 that is 4, then 3 into 3 that is 9, then we have 4 into 4, 16, okay. This can be achieved 
we can have a another function called a torch out bulb m1 comma m2 we will get the same result okay now if you want to do a matrix multiplication so this is element wise multiplication and if you want to do matrix multiplication what we need to do we can have a function called metric mul and we can pass two tensors here m1 comma m2 okay this will do the matrix multiplication okay now next so this is our m1 okay so if you want to access element from this two dimensional matrix what we can do first we can mention the the row okay so if i want to have this one okay i want to get the value at this position what i need to do so i know that this is the zeroth row so i can have zeroth row number and it's a zeroth column so i have to mention m1 0 comma 0 this will give the first value in this position okay similar similar to that if you want to get two if, if i want to get value of this particular position i can select zeroth row and first column okay so here usually in all the list and all the metric operations okay the index will be starting from zero similar to that if i want to get three we know that this is the zero and this is the first row okay so i can have m1 1 then zeroth column so it will be m1 1 0 okay then to get the second item in the first row you can have 1 comma 1 okay this will give us value in this particular position okay so that is all in this video please do like and subscribe have a nice day bye bye